Well, we are now just a couple of days away from the Vikings' first preseason game against the Broncos. So that means today is the final day of training camp. Fox 9's Don Mitchell has the very latest from TCO Performance Center. Today, TCO Performance Center, a last final tune-up against the Broncos before the players have a day off. And yes, start the preseason Saturday afternoon at U.S. Bank Stadium. First, when it comes to defense, co-defensive coordinator Andre Patterson says he's very happy with the way the D-line is coming along. He says Michael Pierce is doing well. He's big, he's strong, and more athletic than given credit for. Now, while many vets like Danielle Hunter have been used sparingly and perhaps not practicing the last couple of of days is not to say they won't get any work in on Saturday. It's really up to the coaches. But Hunter says when he's called upon, don't worry, he is good to go. I mean, after the first practice, I was, I was like, there's nothing for me to worry about. After that, everything felt normal, and I was like, okay, I'm good now. So I'm unrestricted. I can do whatever. I was concerned the first day we went in pads. I wanted to see what was going to happen. You know, I mean, you're a defensive lineman. You're banging somebody every play. So the, the first day in pads was the day that I want to see. Was he going to be timid to put his face in there? And he was not. He looked like his normal self. You know, so after we had the first team rep and it was a run play, and I saw him fit the run like he normally do, then it was, it was all done for me. On offense, same goes for Dalvin Cook. He says he's ready to go and wants to play, quote, whenever number 33 is called. So he plays Saturday in preseason action if he is called upon, and he says he's always 100% ready. The chef also a leader off the field, finishing a commitment to graduate from Florida State with a major in social sciences. What made me go back and finish it up, it was like a promise I made to myself and like a commitment that I stuck to. And like just setting an example for like, you know, the younger kids back home and my brother, he's still in school, my sister's still in school. So setting that example for them of starting something and finishing it, that was like something I, I stuck to myself and, and stood by. So Davin Cook finishing his commitment in the classroom and now he looks forward to starting up another one for the season with the Vikings. At TCO Performance Center, Don Mitchell, Fox 9 Sports.